Hi, everybody. Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Florida State's been hitting on all cylinders the last few games. They've ripped off a string of Ws, trying to extend that streak. But the key is keeping Big Mo on your side. We've done all we can do here. Time to tee it up. Let's send it out to Brad and Kirk for the call. David and I will be with you at halftime. Florida as the teams take the field you can feel the energy increasing in the air let's head down to the coin toss now it's brought to you by Coke Zero real Coca-Cola taste and zero calories enjoy everything Florida State is ready to open this one up as they line up for the opening kick. Robinson from the nine. Tackle made at the 32. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. Throw. I don't think he got anything on that. run is good for a first down. <laughs> this kid certainly isn't known for his feet, but hey, he looked pretty nimble out there to me. Fires out to his wide out. Got an opening. Tackle around the 32-yard line. That'll bring up second and three. Gains his way to the 23 yard line. So he keeps it and he gets a big first down. The quarterback made a very good decision here not to pitch. He saw a break in the defense and just hit it for a big game. Inside the 10. And they make the stop around the three-yard line. They move the sticks after another first down. Impressive drive by this offense so far. I really like what they're doing by keeping this defense on their heels and moving the ball downfield. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. The short yardage defense here. Whitlock will try the right side. Tackle made right around the two-yard line. That brings him second and goal. Taken down in the backfield. So the halfback loses about two on the run. This is the ninth play of this drive. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. 
He's going to run for the end zone, and he doesn't get in. They're going to go for the easy three here. Kicks up, and they tack on three points. Let's get an update now. Here's Reese Davis. Reese. A brief detour to Denton, and for Texas State, they've won two straight. Texas State gets the win, 28-7. In another game, let's get you up to date on what's happening in Evanston. And for Washington, they've dropped two straight. The Wildcats get the W, 31-24. All right, thanks, Reese. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Brooks has it at the 5, at the 30, and he's taken down at the 36-yard line. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. Tackled after a decent pickup. That brings him second and five. From their own 41 yard line. Second down. Let's go, let's go. Here we got Mike, number 53. He's on the run. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. Dives, and he's down. I'm telling you, quarterbacks who can run the ball are so hard to stop. You have to scheme around them, which takes the best coverages out of your defensive playbook. He laterals. He fights forward to about the 46. That makes it second and eight. Second and eight. Ball on the 46. Quick shot to the tight end, and he can't pull it in. Washington was his intention to see on the play. Third down. it out and it falls incomplete. This quarterback needs to be careful not to use his arm strength to try to force things because that's when mistakes happen. Maxi, he's got a chance to put the defense in great position. They can pin their ears back and come after the quarterback. He's tackled at the 20. Personal foul. Face mask. Defense. Still first down. From their own 35-yard line, it's first down. Maryland has a three-point lead. Makes it to the 44, and the halfback picks up nine yards on the delay. That brings in second and one. He's taken down around the 41 yard line. You know, at that point, I think, Brad, the quarterback's just better off just taking a sack. You have to be very careful as you're feeling pressure to throw the ball just to throw the ball. If you feel like you're not going to be able to make a play and the defense got you, just give up on that play and get ready for the next down. Strike to his receiver, no good. That brings us third, and ten. third down now, and they need to get it down to the 31. Back 
He's got it on the foot throw. He's tackled around the 43-yard line. That makes it worth it. Johnson is the putter. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. An exciting first quarter comes to an end. 3-0, Maryland. Welcome back. Tight game here in the second quarter as we begin play. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. He scrambles. Runs with it, and he's got room. And he's tackled at the 34-yard line. Well, this is a nice run for the first down by this quarterback. From their own 34-yard line, first down. He's scrambling. Brought down at the 46. Complete, brought down, nothing doing. So it's complete, but they didn't get much there. And that's because the defense was just waiting on it, and they attacked. The quarterback should have found somebody else downfield. From their own 46-yard line, it's second down. They'll take it inside, but the defense is ready. That took a little too long to develop. Yeah, the offense was trying to get the pass rush going upfield, but the defense did a nice job of sniffing out the draw play and hitting them in the backfield. They'll bring him down at the 42-yard line. It's first and 10. Ball on the 42. He's scrambling. And down he goes at the 42. No that brings up second and nine. He's going to try and scramble. And he's going to be sacked. This quarterback has to do a better job of avoiding the rush because sacks can be real drive killers. Here's the eighth play of the series. Larry, Larry, Larry. 47 Mike, 47 Mike. Mike, 47. Hey, come on, no, come on. Run out, hot. Run. Punching and tending to see the other play. That brings us fourth and 11. He'll try to change the field position and especially not get it to the end zone. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Maryland is up by three. Quick strike, and he drops it. It might not be a lot of fun, but when you're a receiver, you've got to be able to take some hits and hang on to the football. It's just part of the game. From their own 20-yard line, second down. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. And he's taken down at the 32-yard line. First down. He makes his way to about the 45. Oh, 
makes it first and ten. First down, ten yards to go. Ball on the 45. Here's an opening. He gets out to about the 44-yard line. First down. Quick to the receiver and it falls incomplete. Second down and ten to go. Ball on the 44-yard line. The Terrapins running back down there on the sideline. He was injured earlier. He means a lot to this offense, but I think he's going to be able to come back in. Looks like he's ready to go. Makes the grab and steps out right away. First down. So they're going to try to determine if the receiver had possession and was inbounds or not. So the referee initially calls it a catch, but we'll get a second look at it here and determine if he was inbounds when he hauled it in. And that play happened so fast that it was very tough to tell if he was able to get a foot down or not. After review the play, the ruling on the field stands. Well, I think the play warranted a review, but the call on the field stands. Maryland is up a field goal. try to buy some time. He gets sacked on the play. You can't take sacks like that as a quarterback. You just can't. If you can't find a receiver, get out of the pocket and throw the ball away. Defense looking for another sack here on this second and 13 situation. Quick throw out to the receiver, incomplete. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. He's under some heat. He's looking for six. Touchdown, Maryland. He hits the PAT. So a nine play, 79 yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Johnson has the ball set, and he looks ready to kick this one deep. Turner takes it from the six. Tackle made at the 33 yard line. The offense is looking to be a little bit more successful with this drive as they had to punt the ball away the last time they had it. And he's hit immediately. Nice looking play that time. Well, the defense was blitzing here, and again, great recognition by the quarterback to find the hot receiver. Got a first and ten. Ball on their own 49. He makes it out to maybe the 49 yard line. Nowhere to go on the delay. Florida State will take a timeout. That's their first of the half. throw out to the receiver back to the line maybe a yard on the pass it's a nice catch by the junior wide receiver but an even better effort by the defense to keep him from going anywhere pulls it in and he's in the open field 
tackle around the 37-yard line. Great job by the quarterback. He had a slant called against zone coverage and threw it at the perfect time. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 37-yard line. Fires it out. Tackle made right around the 22-yard line. Scrambling around. Inside the 10. And they make the stop at the 1. Quick out to his receiver. He's knocked out of bounds at the one yard line. We're at play number nine of this current drive. Kicks up, and it splits the uprights. They're probably just going to squib this kick. I don't think they want to see the return man create lightning before halftime. From his own goal line, he's taken down at the 25. A tight first half of football, and we head to the break. 10-3, Maryland. Davis, thanks guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. From the seven. He's out to the 30. Across midfield. Inside the 30. The 10. Touchdown. Seminole. What a phenomenal effort. He did a great job of setting up his blocks and then used some great field sense to get into the open. Once that happened, there was no stopping him. Here comes the kicker to try to tie this game up. And he adds the extra point. He's out to the 30. They'll bring him down at the 34. I think it says something about the quality of the preparation of both teams that we're into the third quarter and nobody's been able to pull away. Both sides seem to know what to expect. Completes it, but he can't shake the defense. That makes it second and six. Makes it out to about the 50. So let's go. With the carry. That's how we do it. 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 That makes it first and 10. Verse 22, verse 22. Check four, check four. Let's go. Easy, easy, easy. Easy, easy, easy. Quick pass. Makes his way out to about the 35. Gaining 12 yards. First down. Bring it! Back 22, back 22. Hey! Not a hole! 
There's a strike complete. He's taken down at the 32. Fights forward to about the 29. That makes it third and three. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Dorsey gains around three yards on the option play. Gains his way to the 16-yard line. First down. left the running backs got it he's tackled at the 16 they didn't have much of a chance on that play boy this defense has a lot of speed they're all over him by the time he caught the ball they go back to him on a quick throw big play there and now they're looking at first and goal that makes it first and goal Touchdown, Turks. And he converts the extra point. Johnson gets set to kick this one away. He's to the 20. He's pushed out of bounds at the 26. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. He's on the run. Slides down. Well, they didn't pick up the first down, but he saw that no one was open, so he made the right decision to tuck it and run. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. 35, 35, 35. I can't believe they let you play. Run left side. He makes it out to maybe the 36 yard line. Second and 13 coming up here. Ball on their own 33. Fires quickly to the tight end. He's at midfield. Inside the 30. That's a great tackle at the 15. First and ten after the big pass play. And he throws it away.
throws it in a hurry. And he's tackled at the 12-yard line. That play was going nowhere. Yeah, give a lot of credit to the defense here, recognizing pass and swarming to the receiver. Here's third and eight. Ball on the 12-yard line. Here we go! Flips it, middle to the running back. Brought down at about the 11. Well, he caught it, but it's almost no yards gained, and now it's fourth down. Give props to the D here for coming up with a big stop on third down. So at the end of the third quarter, Maryland leads 17-10. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. And down he goes, right around the two-yard line. This is the ninth play of this drive. Terrific coverage, and when you clog up passing lanes like that, you can force a quarterback to make some poor decisions. Almost got themselves a turnover, too. They're at the two. It's second down. He's scrambling. Shows some moves, and he's in. So they punch it in on the ground, Kirk Herbstreit. Great job up front by the offensive line. They get a good, strong push that allowed the runner to get it in there for the touchdown. Here's the PAT to tie this thing up. And he tacks on the extra point. Here's an update from the studio and restate. Baylor in action over in Waco. And for West Virginia, here's a team that's been ice cold. The Mountaineers have the edge, 3-0. Meanwhile, Ohio doing battle in Athens. And for Ohio, they've gone out in front. The Bobcats have the lead, 3-0. Thanks, Reese. We're tied at 17 here. Holloway looks ready to kick this one off. He'll return it from the one. And he's taken down at the 24-yard line. Well, this is turning into a shootout here. Now, remember, the last time we saw this offense out in the field, they answered the bell and scored a touchdown. Can they do that now a second time? You've got to be aware that capitalizing on this drive is crucial. You want to take the pressure off you and put it on your opponent. Here's the throw, and I don't think he got anything on that. Tries to get out of trouble, but he can't shake the defense. The protection broke down. The defense was in the backfield in a hurry, and they brought the quarterback down. Nice play. Here's third and 11. Ball on 24. And he's taken down around the 48 yard line. Call it a gain of 13 yards. First down. Looks quick to his tight end, and he can't hang on. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 48-yard line. Dumps 
Gets it complete over the middle. Tackle at the 49. pressure he goes downtown they knock it down incomplete great instinctive timing by the corner to deflect the pass that's just really solid coverage skills Brooks back deep to return he's tackled at the 22 yard line We might have overtime in the back of our minds, but down on the field, that hasn't occurred to anyone. They want to end this thing in regulation. Just under three to go in regulation. He's going to try and scramble. Tackle made at the 45. their own 45-yard line. First down. Gains his way to the 46-yard line. four-yard line. It's first down. Fires out to his wideout. He's taken down around the 28-yard line. That'll bring up second and three. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. Now he's scrambling. He's tackled at the 23. From the 23-yard line, first down. Just under two to go in the game. And he tackles him hard at the 11-yard line. in the backfield for a loss. Call it a loss of three yards on the play. That brings up second and 13. And this is the eighth play of the drive. And they get nice yardage on that run. Florida State's going to take their first time out of the half. Ball inside the 10-yard line. It's third down. Well, the player of the game might come from the defense after that stop here late in the fourth quarter. That could be the turning point. Super effort by the defense here to stuff him at the line and force the offense into a fourth down situation. The kick is away. And it sails through the uprights. They're lined up to kick, and they might just kick it short and prevent a long return. Fielded at the nine. He's out to the 30. 
He's taken down at the 42-yard line. Here we are late in the fourth quarter in a very important and a very tight football game. And who's going to come to the forefront? We'll see who's got the most leadership. Going deep. Lays it out there. Oh, he had the pick and he dropped it. Robinson was the intended receiver on the play. That makes it second and ten. From their own 42-yard line, it's second down. One last play, folks. It's time to find out how far he can throw it and see if this game becomes one of the all-time greatest. Here we go. He wants it all. Almost intercepted. It's final. A close one to the very end. 2017 Seminole. That brings this broadcast to a close. For EA Sports and Kirk Herb Street, I'm Brad Nessler. We'll see you soon for another edition of NCAA Football 14.